Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to calculate the odds of winning South African Powerball. And this is winning uh, first prize in South African Powerball, which is where you correctly pick five numbers from 50, and then you also pick uh, correctly pick one number from 20 to win uh, first prize. And I've had a, um, a request from Tash3113 um, asking if I could uh, do a video showing how to calculate the odds of South African Powerball. So I thought to myself, why not? That sounds like a good idea. So uh, what I'm going to do then is I'm just going to randomly select uh, the numbers, five numbers from the top 50 and one number from the uh, Powerball. And hopefully by doing, doing it this way, it'll help you understand uh, understand how the odds are calculated. So um, I'm just going to pick uh, five random numbers in the top section and just pretend that this is your uh, Powerball coupon and then you've got the Powerball there uh, down the bottom which I'll pick one number from. So uh, let's see, I may as well, since I've uh, talked about Tash 31 13, I may as well pick 31 13 randomly and I'll have 28 as well. Uh, 46 and maybe something from the top line uh, let's say five so there we go I've picked one two three four five numbers and down here I'll pick um, I'll pick a random number there for the Powerball as well okay so what happens then when you're watching the draw there's 50 numbers in the barrel and you've got one two three four five chances in 50 of uh, five chances in 50 of the first number being drawn also being on your Powerball coupon as, as being one of the numbers that you've selected. So say then um, it, that is successful then we'll just mark off randomly one of those numbers and pretend that number 28 was drawn and then uh, when the next numbers numbers drawn then you've left with uh, four uh, remaining numbers on your coupon but now there's only 49 numbers in the barrel. So it's because one's already been drawn, so you've actually got only left with 49 numbers in the, in the barrel to be drawn from. So then uh, you've got four chances in 49 of, um, of matching the second number that's drawn. And the same with the third number. Then the third number, there's one, two, three numbers left um, on your coupon that you can match with the number being drawn and now there's of course two numbers have already been drawn out of the barrel you're left with 48 balls in the barrel to choose from so you've got three chances in 48 then of matching um, the third number that's drawn on your coupon okay and then the next uh, the fourth number that's drawn you've left with one two chances then two chances left uh, we've got two numbers left on your coupon that haven't been matched and now three numbers have already been drawn out of the uh, out of the barrel so you've got 47 numbers left in the barrel to match the uh, fourth number that's drawn okay so to match the last number on the um, on your coupon then uh, you've only got one number left to match so you've got one chance in 46 because you've already You've already had four numbers being drawn, and so then you've only got 46 numbers left in the barrel. And to do that, um, then this is the odds. So all you've got to do now to work out the odds of matching those first five numbers is to multiply all those numbers across across the uh, across the page. So I get out my trusty calculator. Okay, so I'll just multiply out those uh, top row of numbers. 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 and that gives you 120 so you've got 120 chances and now in and then you've got to multiply out the the bottom row of numbers 50 times 49 times 48 times 47 times 46 so it's 50 times 49 times 48 times 47 times 40 oh wait that should have been 46 and then it equals uh, 254 million 251,200 so I'll write that on my 254 
So that means that um, matching those first five numbers, you've got 120 chances in 254 million. And we'll simplify that, uh, that fraction by dividing the top and the bottom by 120. So 120 over 120 is one, So, but we just simplify that fraction. So then obviously 120 divided by 120 equals one. Because we want to find it as one chance in something. And then 254,251,200 2, divided by 120 equals 2,118,760. So there we go, that's um, not quite finished yet, but that's the chance then of picking those first five numbers, is you've got one chance in 2,118,760, but then you also have to match uh, the Powerball number, and you've got one chance then in 20. Yep, one chance in 20 to match the, um, to actually correctly match that, um, that Powerball number. And if you do, then you win first prize in the South African Powerball. And all we need to do now to find the odds is multiply the one times the one. Yep. And then we multiply the 200, and, uh, sorry, the 2,118,760 by 20 and that's already in my calculator multiply that by 20 and there we go that's one chance in 42 million three hundred and seventy five thousand two hundred so there we go that's the odds of uh, winning south african powerball picking uh, winning the first prize in south african powerball picking the five numbers and the powerball in one game is one chance in 42,375,200 and you can google that and you can see that that's the um, that is actually the the answer okay well i hope you've enjoyed this video hope you found it uh, interesting and entertaining thanks for watching and goodbye for now